think about nanotechnology, very often we know medications or almost anything can be very small. But now we're talking about going even smaller. Nanotechnology is one of those technologies that really improvises all technologies that are shaping our culture, our civilization, as we live today in this world. Nanotechnology is a technology that sees things in a very, very small scale. We don't really see that, that side of the world, but now we do because of the technology that we have. So that's what I think is interesting about it. It's already there. The fact that we're able to study it and see it right now, that makes it very exciting and inspiring. It gives you a chance to get to parts of the body because of the fact that these particles are so tiny and so small, they can reach limits that we didn't have the ability to do it before. I believe that nanotechnology and the pharmaceutical industry are kind of hand in hand actually at this point because we can create novel drugs that at the nanoscale, they can be used to target specific tissues that drugs currently actually can't. You know, this particular program originated here at the USF College of Pharmacy as we were beginning to look forward into the future. Uh, we want it to be much more uh, futuristic. It's an opportunity to become a clinician, a researcher, manufacturer, a career builder, all at one time, and the program is very innovative, and transformative, and brand new. The Master of Science in Pharmaceutical Nanotechnology is the only program in the state of Florida, but also it's the only program in the United States. The main focus of the uh, MSPN program is to prepare uh, our students, our young people, for their career in science, but also prepares them to get into higher education in other sciences, for example, a PhD in medicine or a PhD in engineering. So if they really want to go into higher education, MSPN program prepares them thoroughly for that education. It's really up to the student uh, what are their goals and what they want to do with their life. So you can go for public health, you can go for professional programs like the MD or PharmD, you can go to veterinary school. There are pharmaceutical programs, there are nanotechnology programs, but the combination of both has not been there and that's, that's definitely innovative. No matter what kind of job they do, they will be always the most competitive because in the whole country, there may be programs where there are MS degrees, but these MS degrees are not in pharmaceutical nanotechnology. Many students, after finishing their bachelor's, they want to go to professional degree programs. They want to go to doctor of medicine, they want to go to PharmD, they want to go to veterinary sciences, they want to go to um, dentistry, and all the students need to make themselves more competitive. Our program actually offers courses uh, at a graduate level that will make them more competitive. 